Hello everybody, my name is Rojo and welcome back to Outcast Second Contact. When we last left off, we made our way into uh, the city of Talonzar. Or well, the region of Talonzar. I think the city is like o Oka Sankar or something like that. And uh, things have been going pretty smoothly so far. Except for that little stutter there. <laughs> uh, who is over here? Have I talked to this person yet? I don't know. Yagu. I don't think I have. This is one of the guys we got to talk to to help out the water guy, I think. Hi there. You are welcome here, Ulukai. I am known as Yagu, and I sell Reese. All right, very uh, to the point. Tell me a little about your wrists. We are taxed for our sales on wrists to the other talents, but we also have to buy the wrists from the soldiers at a high price. It makes it hard for talent to afford the wrists, but it does not matter much because the soldiers take most of the risk produced in Shamazar for themselves. Not anymore, they don't. Yagu, I need to talk to you about Haza. This is about me raising my risk price, no? That it is. I need to see if you can lower it again for him, if just for a little while. I wish that I could, Urukai. But I am attempting to raise up enough Zorkins to buy my way into Shamazar for a moon to find my brother. Buy your way? Yes. No talent except for soldiers and those delivering goods can enter a Daoka without an order from a soldier. I was going to pay a soldier to order me to Shamazar, but he was reverted recently when Croax found out he had done so for another talent. So you are trying to find another soldier now, is that it? Yes. I have heard no word from my brother in over a thousand moons, and I am desperate to make sure that he is still alive. All right. Well, we knew it was going to come to this. What can I do to help, providing that you lower your price once I'm done? You have been to Shamazar, yes? Yep. I would ask that you return there and find my brother as if... He works in the wrist fields and does a little bit of building on the temples in that region. If you could find him and let him know that I am still here, that would mean all of Adelpha to me. Sounds easy for a change. And for this, you'll lower your price? I will, Ulukai. All right, I think um, we've met that guy, actually, back when we blew up part of one of the temples or something like that, because there was a rock slide. Or, uh, some kind of something or other. Um, so we should be able to swing that. Uh, there was a, uh, a patch since the last I played, and there is something I think we can fix here. Subtitles, dodge rolls, damage resistance, health bar, enemy info. Yeah, we can turn these definitions off as subtitles. I, uh, I don't know. I like I. I wish there was a way to just see them once, like the first time, and then never again. <laughs> Um, but I'm going to turn them off, and if we see a word we're not familiar with, we can always check our, lex our uh, lexicon to, uh, to, uh, see if we can figure it out. Alright, I don't think we need to talk to this guy. What about a couple soldiers up here? But I don't think they're going to spot us as we're walking over this way. This is just a guy. Wrong house. My, my mistake. We, in fact, would like to go to this guy. Ah, he's not looking so hot. Current prices by all right. Well, what do you got? He has got an upgrade for our pistol, and then he's got the LN Duo 500 and the FT 74X. Um, go get your secret object. What? Uh, what about? Let's see here. So I don't know. I'm gonna guess FT means flamethrower. And then this other one's maybe a rocket launcher. I kinda want the silent B. Um but maybe we couldn't afford it or I didn't see it. I uh, I'm not sure. So uh, I think I'm gonna Actually, you know what? No no no, I am gonna buy from this guy. I'm gonna I'm gonna hope that I get the grenade launcher. I think I'm gonna guess that it's this one. I don't know if that's true or not. 750, do we have enough? We... Go get your do not, I don't think. We're just shy. All right. We're going to need to deal with a couple more soldiers to uh, to be able to afford that. But yeah, 
if we get that grenade launcher, I think when we go back to, to Chemazar, we can grab uh, our grenade launcher and go deal with that uh, big monster in the water, perhaps. Let's see, so we got a guy over there. Um, yeah, let's see if we can see if we can catch up with whoever's over here. I'm not going to break open those pots, because last time we did something like that, we got in trouble for vandalizing a dude's house. I feel like that's not in our best interest. I don't even think we can... Yeah, we can't, we can't even pick that up, so... Not going to worry too much about that. Oh, jeez. Uh, well, looks like this guy's actually outside now. Weapon... Another weapon trader? Buy object. He has just an FT-74X. But not the other upgrade, I guess. Am I losing my mind here? Oh, yeah, there's two weapon traders. Huh. Well, that's... That's interesting. <laughs> Don't know how we got a hold of another grenade launcher, but... Uh, I guess there could have been more than one in our, our equipment that uh, was probably scattered about when we... Uh, I, don't, I don't even... I, not even crash landed, but teleported here and got mixed up somehow. All right, this guy. This is also a wrist merchant. Excuse me, pal. Hi there. You are a pleasant sight to these eyes, Ulukai. Um, thanks, ma'am. My name is not that. It is Nika. Are you a? Yes, I am a Rhys merchant. No, no, um, are you a female? Ulukai makes jokes. <laughs> what a brave being you are with all that goes on around you. To seek to give us all hope with humor. That is why I hate to ask you if you would do me a favor. What? <laughs> um, everybody's, everybody is so unwilling to answer the... <laughs> These questions in this goddamn talent society. Uh, tell me about wrist first. Anything you care to tell me about your wrist? It is fresh from the fields of Shamazar. The farmers there work too hard to deliver it to us. I hope that some moon they will have a reason to stop farming. Uh huh. I'm gonna guess that this is actually a male talent, though, because that one guy said that all the females stay on an island. This is my this is, this is my guess. If if uh, he is to be believed, anyway. Otherwise, this person <laughs> escaped and probably shouldn't be here. What's this favor, Nika? I need some Zorkins, please, Ulukai. What? Now I know you're a female. <laughs> you are a silly one, Ulukai, but I am serious. I need those Zorkins to return a very important object that the soldiers took from me when I was not able to pay my tax this moon. If I do not return it soon, a soldier may lay claim to it, and I will never see it again. And you want me to buy it back? No, I just need to borrow the Zorkins from you so I can get it back. Then I will be able to repay you with a little bonus to reward you for your help. <laughs> Please, Lukai. Why am I getting a crying game feeling here? Notepad. Uh -huh. How much? Well, how much of a loan do you need? It is a very big one, Lukai. 500 Zorkins. Well, I guess we'll hold off on getting any new weapon ready for now. Can you take all of it now? Oh, I can indeed. Thank you, Ulukai. Return later this moon, and I will have it to return to you. With a little something extra on the side. Alright, enough games. What are you? As I said, I am a Reese merchant. No, are you a male or a female? <laughs> I had not heard you were this funny, Ulukai. <laughs> it has been many moons since I laughed. <laughs> All right. <laughs> we'll come back another time and uh, see if he's got anything for us. 
Um, so hopefully, actually, with a with the bonus is a little extra cash, we'll actually be able to afford the weapon. Um, on our way out, so that wouldn't be so bad. We need to be careful here. Somewhere there were some soldiers. I guess they're patrolling around a little bit here. I think if we kind of stick to uh, over here. Be sort of safe. I'm gonna, you know what? Nah, I'm gonna deal with these fellas now, I think. Greetings, friends. Uh, excuse me, I uh, seem to have completely missed that guy. <laughs> oh, jeez, the gun was in the way. Well, we just got something there. Where's this other guy at? Did he jump off the edge? I think he did. He did, son. <laughs> All right, well, let's um, see if we can pick up any uh, any money from these guys. There's a little bit right there. We gave, what, 500 away? Which would have left us with, uh, I think, 226. We got, we got like 10 right there. Not exactly blowing my mind with uh, the returns here, but that's all right. All right, Halidium Carver, what are you? Greetings. I was wondering when you would come see me. Should I know you? Would I? I am the one called Azirat. My skills with Helidium carving are second to no talent. And I cannot wait to help you in your mission. You seem to be bouncing up and down a little bit there, pal. Tell me more about the Helidium carving you do. I am an Eloi talent, and my essence allows me the skill to carve Helidium in very precise way. I have made some very delicate things of beauty and balance, but none of these matter this moon. Why is that? Feyran forces me to use my essence to carve for his soldiers weapons from the Helidium. Carve the weapons? Yes, there is a raw type of essence in the Helidium store itself. Only Fey Talon can use it, though. Feyran discovered that if a Fey Talon uses his essence with a well-carved piece of Elidium that has been made by us, then a stream of dangerous essence comes forth. Yeah, I've seen that. The weapons are works of sheer beauty, such skill. Then they are used and throw away when their essence runs dry. When I hear of what my weapons do to other Talon, it makes my essence cry out. But if I do not continue to make them, another talent will. Such is the life that I am burdened with. I hope I'll be able to put a stop to all that. And this is my hope as well. If you need my services, you let me know. And if you happen to see a talent with a very beautiful piece of carved helidium on a chain, let me know. It was stolen from me this moon. Hmm. I don't recall if we've seen that. Tell me about this thief. I know only he was a Ganda Talon. His clothes were of those from the Motasar miners. And he can run fast. I chased him all the way to the construction bock on the other side of the city before I lost him. How did he steal your piece? When my back was turned, like any good thief would. When next I see him, I would like very much to demonstrate some of my other carving skills to him. What does this thing he stole look like again? A nice piece of helidium on a string to wear around the neck. Notepad hmm. accessed. Before we pursue that, we may want to consider getting the uh, the dart gun or whatever it is, because I think it's the only non-lethal weapon we have aside from punching people in the face. Although, I don't even know if that's non-lethal. Can you tell me more about these weapons? There is nothing I cannot do with a piece of Helidium, Mulukai. If you ever find yourself with a weapon that has need of a type of essence to charge it, I can make it more powerful. Notepad hmm. accessed. My Hawk MK-8, is that such a weapon? What about this? Interesting. 
How does it work? According to the debrief file I read before coming here, it uses an energy charge, which it releases upon full charge. I may have a look at it when you bring me a large enough piece of religion to test with it. Notepad. Hmm. Accessed. So it sounds like, um... With high levels of adrenaline detected. Maybe we'll find, uh, something like that out in the, uh... The mining section? Of, uh, this place? Oh, there's some, uh... Make it's over here, or a make it. I'll take that. That will definitely come in handy at some point. Oh, nice. Here's the recreator. My man, what's up? Pardon me, buddy. Howdy. You are mistaken. My name is not Howdy, Ulukai. I am Gran, a recreator. It means hello. It means hello? Okay. It do you do? Okay. Uh, uh, how may I help you? Um, lots of different stuff we can talk to him about. Uh, we already kind of know about all this stuff. Uh, we don't need anything from this guy right this second. I guess we can see if he can make um some Uza ammo for us. Uh, what about this? What kind of help can you give me? Besides trying to make your weapon fuel for you, I know a little about the soldiers here in Okriana. Do tell. The soldiers in the high town are very fast. They protect Tehran well, and I know little of them. But the soldiers that patrol the low town where we are walk mostly on the stone path or the walls. Try to avoid those areas when you can. And you may have an easier time moving around in Okriyama. Thanks for the tip. Alright, so that's, uh... That's the name of this place, Okriyama. I guess, uh... I don't know, the Okananazar or something? Was that Maybe that's the water area? I don't remember. Okasankar? Was it something like that? Anyway, um, I require from you... Uh... I actually can't make any of the, uh that ammo for the gun we were just talking to the other guy about, but uh, this is what I'm interested in. This is what you needed. All right. Please give me a small amount of time to make these for you, Udokai. Cool. We'll come back later. Metal detected. Hey, there's some guys outside the city here. I'm wondering if I should uh, pop a cap. I'm thinking that perhaps I should... Even though I won't be able to loot them unless I want to jump outside, which strikes me as kind of maybe a bad idea. We'll grab this stuff, though. I don't know why I keep messing with the map. I really should just leave it up like it is right now. But it keeps going away, I guess, every time we uh, get rid of our weapon, I think. Something like that. All right, let's be careful here. There's not a lot of room to dodge. Oh, there's a portal down there. That is interesting. So those guys are just chilling. All right. I can uh can make some stuff happen here. <laughs> gotcha. Defeat soldiers for Zot. Building a good reputation. Uh, I don't know what those achievements were. Did we talk to a guy named Zot? I actually don't recall. Metal detected. I definitely don't want to go through this portal right this second. I forget which uh which one it even is. Go, let's grab that. We'll grab some actual metal as well. There we go. Alright, cool. You know, I'm thinking, since the recreator is down here and there's a portal. Pretty uh, close by. I'm actually gonna drop one of my uh, teleporters, I think, uh, down in this direction. And uh, we should probably put this away so we don't look like an asshole <laughs> too much here. Um, let's see, where where was he? Here we go, right over here. So I'll drop uh, drop one of our. Devices right here in the corner. Um, 
What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? We got... That one goes back to Shemazar. So we will drop uh, this one right here, I guess. And um, we'll move on, I guess. There's actually a guy that we haven't talked to right over this way. I think, um, right here. Zelb. Oh, this is where the bar is. Very nice. And Zack the Metalsmith. We didn't talk to him either. So, uh, let's go ahead and, um, I'm gonna save and take a sec to greet these guys. Hi there. I never believed I would get to meet you, Urukai. Have you need of something metal to be built? I am Zack, and my metal is the best. Is it? Um, a couple different things. Uh, let's ask him about Haza first. So, you raised your price for Haza, yes? I feel bad for doing so, but he was always breaking his cart and bringing it to repair. What was wrong? He works so much with the cart that the metal parts I make begin to bend and break. Each time I repair it, he will not give the metal time to set, and I cannot make him stop. So, he always brings it back, and I always fix it the best I can, but he is taking up too much of my time. Sounds like the metal isn't strong enough. No, I do not think so either. But the parts he wants are so small, and I cannot see how to make the metal stronger unless you could help me, Ulukai. Uh-huh. How can I help? I have heard Talon talk of the sacred object you use as a weapon against the soldiers that is all metal. I think it is called the HKP-12. Yes. I would like to study the secrets of the Yard's metal and see if I can find a way to make my metal stronger. If I could borrow your HKP-12, I may be able to do this. You aren't gonna take it apart or hurt it, are you? No, I simply need to study the metal. That doesn't sound too difficult. May I borrow your HKP-12? Ah, uh, yeah, I think we can make that happen. I want this back in the same condition, all right? It will not be touched, Urukai. Return in a short time and I will see if I have been able to find anything. If so, I will lower my price for Ezra. Notepad. All right. What can you build? I have built almost anything you will see with metal on it. Traps in Oka, family bracelets for all Talan, even the machines in Mutazar. The rock crusher there was my largest work. The crusher part took me 300 moons to build. Wow. Um, interesting. I was hoping you could give me some upgrades of some kind, but I guess not. Maybe after he's done uh, playing with our gun. Alright, there's the bar open. There's also another weapon trader over here. How many of these guys are there? Buy ammo, buy items. Well, I'm not gonna buy anything from him, but... Good to know he's here, I guess. What is, uh, what's in here, actually? It's another house. More pots and stuff that we probably shouldn't break. Alright. Nice place. Not much to drink for a bar, though. Can I take that? No, I guess not. Can I ask you something? Are you the one called Zelb? I am. The Shamaz told me you know where Marion is being held. I have heard this, yes. Well? There is a matter of payment to be discussed first. Zelb, have you heard about what I can do with my weapons? I have heard, yes. Want a first-hand demonstration? The strange one is with the rebels in a house to the west of the Palace Fay. Five soldiers were here just moments ago and beat the information from a guardian who was here. You will have to hurry. Notepad. Oh, God. Uh, a house to the west? Which way is west? This way. Five soldiers. Um... Not doing a very good job of hurrying. Let's see, Marion is a house to the west of the Palace Fay. Alright, um... I mean, that could be... Any of these houses, really, right? Because if we face that way, that's east, so this way is going to be west, so... She's around here somewhere. <laughs> um... 
I guess uh, let's start checking on houses, shall we? You are you done already? Did you find anything? I was able to see many things in this metal Ulukai. But I am afraid that I lost one of the little pieces that was inside the metal. You said you were not going to touch it. I was curious. Forgive me, Urukai. But I studied the other ones and was able to make a new one. You made a screw that quickly? Of course. I can make anything from metal. Not bad. Just hope it doesn't fall apart on me now. It should not, Urukai. But if anything happens, I will repair it for no Zorkins. Speaking about Zorkins reminds me. Tell Heza his price is lower. I will. And again, I am sorry that I took apart your weapon. I would like you to have this as a way of saying sorry. It is just that I get around metal, I lose my control. I'm the same way with old radios. All right, fair enough. Uh, yeah, hopefully our gun isn't busted. <laughs> that would suck. But uh, yeah, let's... Let's get a move on here and see if we can find out which house she's in here. I'm going to start by looking at these houses that are kind of more, uh, more toward the, uh, the south side of the city, I guess, since we're uh, in the area. Let's see here. Lydium Carver guy. Don't need anything from him right now. Somewhere there's a way to get in here, I would think, but apparently not. <laughs> okay. Anything up here? Uh, does not look like it. Son of a... There's my, uh, teleport device. Don't want to pick that up just yet. There's a couple guys there. That I will have to deal with if I, if I keep going uh, in this direction. Uh, some of these houses don't even have fucking entrance. <laughs> There's no entrance to these houses. What's going on here? All right, well. What's up, guys? Excuse me, fellas. Just uh, doing a little search and rescue here. Don't mind me. Well, most of these houses don't have any way to get in, so I guess we'd be looking for a house that actually has an entrance on the map, right? One would think. Like, you can kind of see them. So I guess that's what we should focus on. There's a guy over here that we can chat up as well, so I suppose... We may as well do that while we're here. Don't think we have to worry about any soldiers right now. Senkar seller. Yo, Shorty. Hello. Ulukai. Gizo am me. I mean, I Gizo me. Gizo, I am so nervous. Why? I cannot believe I am standing here talking to the Ulukai. My friends will never believe this. Take it easy, uh, Gizo, was it? You said my name. Oh, the yogs do smile on me this moon. I Sankar sell. What? I sell Sankar. And I have looked forward to this since I began hearing the stories of the Ulukai. Oh yes, before I forget, I have something to ask you. What was it? Uh, I don't know. What's Sankar? Tell me about your Sankar. These are the animals that swim in the waters of Oka Sankar. The Sankar catchers of that region must give most of what they catch to the soldiers. But what little they can, they send here for we and the Sankar Bok to sell. Aha. Uh -huh. What was your question? I was... I cannot believe you are here. I am, so what was your question? There was something I was going to give you. Something important. What was it? All the time in the world. Just take a breath and say it. Now I remember. You travel between the regions, yes? And you don't? It is forbidden. All who are found outside their region without permission are reverted. Okay, so what about it? A few moons ago, I found this family bracelet inside a caravan of Sankar from Oka Sankar. I was wondering, and I hate to ask this of you. Ask. 
could you return this to the Talan it belongs to? I am certain it must be one in the region of Okasankar. He is most likely worried greatly that it is missing. All right, I suppose we can swing that. What is a family bracelet? The bracelet is a ring of metal that has inside it the names of all of the family now and in the past. When the oldest of the family is reverted, then the next one in the family must take care of it. What happens when they fill one? More rings of metal are added. The bracelet becomes wider. The circle continues. Since Feran arrived to power, many family bracelets have been broken because no more of the family were left. The last Talam is then sent to the yards with the bracelet in his possession. Hmm, that's interesting. Is there anything you can tell me about... Oka Sankar? I can only say that it is a region filled with water, because that is all I know of it. Since I have never been there, I only know it through stories. One moon, I would like to visit there, to see the Sankar that I sell alive and in the water moving about. I only can wonder what they might look like. Hmm. All right, my man. Well, I gotta, I gotta find this lady before uh, some bad shit happens. So, <laughs> you'll excuse me. There we go. Here's a house we can actually walk into. So that's a start. Greeting, citizen. Uh, don't mind me. About your business, etc., etc. Okay, there are some soldiers over there. I'm not gonna. I'm not going to try to chase them down. Let's just uh, check these. We're not really even even west of the, the, the Temple Fay anymore. But uh, we might as well look in here while we can. Alright, so I think we've checked pretty much everything here that we need to. Um, let's see if we can get in here, actually. No. Oh, hello. <laughs> I think that guy was laying on the ground and I just stepped on him. So we've talked to all those people. Let's, um... Let's go south here, maybe swing around this way and, uh... Check in here? Hmm. I'll take those. You don't need those, right? Probably not. Probably not. <laughs> just, just a hunch. What about you? No, you're... You're just a guy. Alright. This is gonna lead to the rooftops, which is not really... particularly useful. There's some metal over there. I guess we can jump over here and grab it. Is that some Zorkins, probably? All right, so I think we've already, we we were just in this building right here. There's nobody there. There's nobody here. There are some soldiers there though. Maybe if we tail those guys. Excuse me. You want to get out of my way, please? Weapon trader. No detected, don't care about that. Oh yeah, that was nice. That was pretty nice. Aha, here we go. Slade, you've no idea how glad I am to see you. Where are the others? Gee, Marion, it's nice to see you, too. Why, thank you, Cutter. Damn it, Wolf, do you know where they are or not? I've not seen Kaufman, but I think I saw Zoo. You think? Well, it looked like him. But this person was ordering around the soldiers that knocked me out and brought me here. Uh, he looked different, older. Zoo was directing the soldiers? Are you sure? Not 100%, but... It sounded like his voice. I wonder. Hey, you know something else? I was supposed to teleport ten minutes after you, but they pushed up my departure time. I left right after you. 
The scientists were rushing around screaming something about a probable temporal anomaly. You gotta be kidding me. This is just perfect. Did you say Zoo? Yeah. Zoo is a name I know. Kazar fight with Feyran many times. Call him Zoo. My father told me this. Wait, that can't be right. Jan, how long ago was Kazar killed? Kazar was with us for many thousands of moon and was reverted soon after Feyran arrived. Feyran has ruled Adelpha for 10,000 moons, I think. Call it woman's intuition, but I don't think Zoo is playing for the same ball club anymore. You think Zoo killed Kaufman? No, I thought he was a wheezy little shit, but a murderer? Well, I may be the new girl on the block, but where else did these talent learn English? Kazar taught all the high language of Aga Kaman. It would explain why the Mon they want me to find are computer cards. Thought that was kind of strange. Well, so if Kaufman is gone and Zoo is this Fay Ran guy, where's the probe? If they were here for such a long time, does that mean it's been here all this time as well? I don't think so. Why? These Talans say that Kazar instructed them to hide these Mon, these cards, where Zoo couldn't get them. I'm guessing that we still might be in need of them. So what now? I'll find the Mon. You go on back with this Guardian and we'll meet up when I'm finished. I want to help, Slade. You will, by staying safe where I know I can come get you in a hurry. I didn't go through basic training for nothing, you know. Yeah, well, you didn't exactly get in the way most SEALs have to, did you? Or did you forget that your senator of a mother greenlighted your butt into our basic? And you didn't exactly finish at the top of the class, or at all, as I remember. You asshole. It wasn't my fault. That is exactly why you're going back with this Guardian. You are unreliable in a stressed situation, and I'm not going to catch fire for you again. Do you read me? You and me are going to have words about this later, mister. Ooh, I'm all tingly with anticipation. Well, that could have gone better. <laughs> Finding it hard to catch our prey, my leathery friend? The female is not important, Veyron. We must concentrate on stopping the Ulukai. He begins to give the other Talon hope. Oh, but she is important. With Wolf in my grasp, I could easily lure that Boy Scout into a trap. I have ordered all patrols to be on the alert. My soldiers will stop him without your tricks, Veyron. I hope you are not speaking of the same soldiers that failed to dispose of Slade's unconscious, defenseless body the day he arrived. Feyran! Those Talan are the ones that keep you in power! You should not talk badly of them! Or what, Primitive? You'll turn them against me? <sighs> I am the voice of the Fey. All fear my wrath. What could you possibly say that would sway them from me? I could tell them how you are a fake. Heed my words, lizard, before I forget what little need I have for you. Never again use that word in my presence. This bickering is pointless. You will find a female wolf and bring her to me, unharmed. And the Ulukai? Deliver him, extremely harmed, if you please. All right. Explosive detected. Very uh, interesting turn of events here. I'll, I'll be taking these, I think. Thank you very much. All right. Well, we found Marion, but uh, we didn't really get to uh, hang out with her very much here. Oh, Nika. Oh, we can actually. Act. Just a quick question. Yes, Ulukai. Is Nika a male or a female? Are you making a joke? No, I'm not making any jokes. I want to know. Well, if you must know, Nika is a... Ah, uh, my essence. What? That is curious. Which bok am I in? This is the wrist bok. Most Talan get their wrist from Yagu or Nika. Fair enough. <laughs> 
<laughs> that was a uh, very curious turn of events when we asked about Nika there. Okay, well, it looks like this part of uh, of uh, the city is pretty well cleared, so we basically have the eastern part that we need to worry about now. Uh, however, speaking of Nika, she ought to have our uh, our money back at this point. Although I have a feeling we may not get it back. She was never really quite clear about how that was going to work out. So uh, there's a non-zero chance that we may, may just need to kiss that 500 Zorkins goodbye. Let's find out. Did you get your object yet? I have Urukai. The soldier was most helpful once he saw me. Was he? Yes. I did not even have to use all the Zorkins you gave me, since he was interested in something else. Would you like your Zorkins back, plus the extra I saved? Um, yes. Yes. What was he interested in? That is private business between him and I, and I promise not to say anything. Here are your Zorkins, and as I promised, I have something special for you. I'm almost afraid to ask. You do not need to ask, Ulukai. I am giving it to you right now, whether you like it or not. But I hope that you do. Hey, thanks. Oh, it was my pleasure, Ulukai. I wonder, though, if I may ask you another favor? What's that? I have been walking around all moon with no shirt on. Since I'm not usually doing that, all the other Talon are staring at me. Could you help me find it? I feel so naked without it. I can't take this anymore. <laughs> oh my god, all right. Uh... What exactly was this object you got back? It was my bracelet. Ah. Now I see. My father wore it before he was reverted. Damn. Oh, I mean, I'm sorry. It is okay, Ulukai. It has been a long time since then. But his mother wore it before she was reverted, and so it goes in our family. Kinda boy-girl, boy-girl, huh? No. There is no order. <laughs> the oldest child wears the family bracelet. This is hopeless. Yes, it is. I think we we should probably just just let that let that rest and accept that we will never know the answer. <laughs> um, what did, what did, what did he give us though? Um, let's see here. I, thought I saw something like a new sort of item. We got this bracelet, right? But we're gonna give that to somebody else. Maybe it was just money. I thought I saw like a rectangular sort of object, but um, I don't know. We have a thousand Zorkins though, so that's pretty good. Uh, let's see if we can go find... Let's see if we can go find uh, that grenade launcher now. Because I think... We're going to want to have this. Go. My object, by weapons. Yeah, the duo. Um... Sure. Take your damn Zorkins. Make sure you scare other Talon when using this, okay? Drag my prices up. Mmm, I don't know about that. How much are your objects, creep? Have you been sleeping or something, Ulukai? No Talon seems to be fearful of you anymore. Hardly any who stop me want to buy a sacred object even at their lowest price. Could you not scare them up a bit more? I need to catch up to my brothers. Hmm, so if we create civil unrest, he'll lower his prices, I guess. I, I'm not going to do that. <laughs> I think that sounds like a bad idea. Uh, but yeah, let's, let's see what we got here. Is this what I hope that it is?
Yeah, it absolutely is. Uh, however, I don't want someone to accidentally walk on this. So I'm hoping I can... There it is. Okay. Apologies for the, uh, <laughs> for the confusion, boys. Um, don't mind me. Uh, let's put that away. So, uh, yeah, that weapon... Oh, there's something here. There's a little bit of money. Um, yeah, so that weapon is gonna shoot mines initially, I think, and then I think it shoots grenades, and then I think it shoots... I think it shoots bouncing grenades, and then I think at the final upgrade level it shoots, um... Grenades that detonate Go on impact. Dead, Something like that. I'm not 100% sure. But, um... We'll find out as we go, I guess. Hopefully we can use it as is to defeat that water monster over in, uh... Over in Shamazar. However, before... Oh, look at that on the map. They made it so uh, our teleporters show up now. Which is very nice. Hard to see that other one up there. But yeah, I think um, before we go back to Shamazar, we're going to clear out what we can of the rest of this city. You know, probably sends the uh, the high city, at least, because it sounds like that's a pretty dangerous place. 